Hey, I've been I've been reading a lot tonight about uh, net neutrality. For the first time, I saw a Ted Kennedy thing on YouTube about it, and he he seemed pretty pretty passionate about about keeping net neutrality. And uh, the ISPs right now, AT and T, amongst the largest, and others, the the, the companies that are, that we pay to let us onto the internet want to now get rid of net neutrality. Now, net neutrality is this concept, this idea that the internet is a, a wide open place, uh, a free place where everyone can go and experience the same experience, the same internet experience. You pay your X amount of dollars per month for your DSL and you're on and you're in. Um, getting rid of that now is going to mean that uh, when you log in through, say, AT&T, it's going to be up to AT&T what websites you can access faster, what websites you're going to see, uh, what, what links you're going to see, what websites are going to be slow. So they say so, some websites can be, I mean, without net neutrality, as slow as they want to the point where you can't get to them or it's incredibly difficult to get to them. So it will, it will be allowing the ISPs, the internet service providers, to dictate what our internet experience will be like. I don't like this idea because I like that the internet is a place where I can innovate, where I can create, where I can express myself freely and openly and I can interact with people freely and openly because I pay my 60 bucks a month or my 40 bucks a month or whatever. I don't like the idea that somebody is going to dictate what I, my perception of, of the internet. The whole point is that it's somewhere we can all go to be together. Uh, whoever, Al Qaeda uh, and the U.S. government, they, they interact on the internet. That's, that's how they make contact. And I think that making contact is incredibly important. I think that the internet is, is going to be what leads this world. I mean, obviously, this is what's going to bring this world together. Obviously, how would it be anything else? This is the way that we're going to be able to start to make things happen and stop blowing each other up. Now, the government is considering dropping net neutrality because they're paranoid and they're paranoid and they they think that it's allowing terrorists uh, access to vital information about US secrets or US people or all that and it's like shit this 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 defeats the purpose in my opinion of the internet the the free internet the open the, the open free okay so the open free the open free internet Anyway, there's a website that I probably will have been flashing throughout this. Um, it's savetheinternet.com, and this is what you can do. Uh, you need to contact your senator, your state senator, and you can do that from this website. You go to this website, uh, www.savetheinternet.com, and on it, it's all about the uh, campaign to save the, the, uh, the internet freedom. Um, on the right now, you can track your senator. You click a button, take you to a link. Click on the state that you live in. It'll show you the senator. It'll show you what their view is. If they're not for net neutrality, you need to call them and make sure that they are that they hear your voice. Leave them a message. I'm gonna do it. Well, the California Senate, they, they say they're both for net neutrality. California's pretty progressive, but. I'll call the other ones anyway. I don't care. I, I, I'm going to start doing something because this is incredibly, incredibly important. So go to this website. Click on, this, click on the senators. See if, if you got a senator that's, that's wavering or that is against it, call them. Call them. They list the number right below the senator's name. Call them. They give you a speech of something that you can say. Call them. If we, this, is, this is secret. This, this passing this, getting rid of this net neutrality, it's a secret thing. No one's really hearing about it, but that's why Ted Kennedy did a YouTube thing about it. It's big. It's a really, really, really big deal, and we need to work together on this. Thank you for your time.